this <laughs> It's okay, just tell him. It's for her, I'm sorry. <laughs> I gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> This is the most spectacular car competition on Earth. This is how we ride. This is really badass. This is like the Fast and the Furious, but in real life. This is so bad. I broke something. I don't go any place to finish second. I'm here to win. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Unreal. This is how we ride. From Netflix comes Hyperdrive, the most incredible car competition you've ever seen. Exotic cars, amazing stunts, it is pure adrenaline on wheels. And joining me right now are two of the contestants and hosts of Hyperdrive, Brittany Williams and Aaron Parker. Hey guys. How's Hello, it going? Hello Jeff, how are you? Greetings from Las Vegas. Greetings, are the grasshoppers gone? Oh no, they attack me every day, everywhere I go. <laughs> that sucks. So Brittany, let's start with you. How do you become one of the top drifters in Texas? You're flattering me a lot. <laughs> but honestly, it's so obviously drifter in Texas, and this is any motorsport, and I'm pretty sure any race car driver, no matter what you drive, can attest to this. It's 100% about having the passion for what you're doing and just enjoying driving yeah. your vehicle. But it's also about seat time. When it comes to improving your skill level, the more time that you can have behind the wheel of your vehicle, the more time you have to practice, the better you'll improve, the quicker you'll improve, and you know, it's how you kind of get to the top. Yeah. And Aaron, to pursue your passion of exotic cars, uh, you call yourself a hustler mechanic, but you also have four jobs? How do you even make that work? Oh man, really, I, you know, sometimes I ask myself the same question, <laughs> but uh, I think it's passion driven, and every time I get tired, I just think that like, life is so short, and if you make the most out of every second, that will lead to something. And to me, it's, it's got to be something. You know, I'm like in a position to where I want to lead the best example for my brothers and sisters. I want to make my family very proud for me. And so it's kind of just naturally flows out of me. You know, that energy. My mom had the same energy. She just got things done. And so I think it uh, might just be in my blood, you know, I think. <laughs> So let's talk more details about Hyperdrive. This is fast and furious for real. Tell me some details of the competition. Absolutely, so Hyperdrive, it's literally, it's Ninja Warrior meets Fast and Furious. Mm -hmm. And it's a, basically, it's a, comp a competition show where they took 28 drivers from around the entire world. And these are drivers from different types of motorsports. You right. have drag racing, you have drifting, you have autocross, you have everything. And then they pit us all against one another in, an obstacle course that Giant. <laughs> no race car driver could have ever imagined going up against. Some of these obstacles have never been attempted uh, in a competition setting at all. No. I mean, we've got a six-story tall teeter-totter. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> Make it an impression to test it. <laughs> to push your limits. Every time I leave the start line at a race, I want my family to be proud of me. This is the most spectacular car competition no! on Earth. He only knows one way. Not only are you both professional drivers, but you're daredevils too. But there's some really outrageous stunts in this TV show. Did you look at some of these stunts and went, no way, I am not doing that? Or did you have the attitude is, get out of my way, I can't wait to do it? You know, like, when, when we were told about some of the stunts, I'm like trying to imagine what it would be in my head, and I was like, is this going to be safe? You know, is it, but I mean, it was all safe, but in my mind, I'm very critical, and very measured, and I'm always like, this can't be real. You know, them imagining these crazy obstacles and everything, and you get to it, and you're like, it's did real. not think of that, it and it's real. real, and it's crazy. And for me, I mean, you get up to it, and you're like, oh, you got it, though. You can't, like, <laughs> like, like full send. You yeah. have to try it because or you can go home or you can go home yeah. like that's the only other option I didn't come all this way uh, not just for the show but also in my life in my driving career right. to chicken out like and maybe we have a screw loose I don't know but when it's something you're passionate about you'll do just about anything to achieve your goals mm -hmm. 
One of the most incredible things about Hyperdrive is executive producer Charlize Theron. I had no idea she was a car guru. So me neither. Neither did I. Until yeah. the show, I did not know that Charlize was an automotive enthusiast. And I have to say personally, I was super stoked about this because obviously finding other women car enthusiasts is so amazing. And the fact that I got to see her get so hyped and so excited, not just to see the cars and the drivers, but also to get in the vehicles with some of the other drivers was pretty crazy. Yeah, you get these like preconceived notions of who someone might be, you know, just based off of like media in general. And like when you see her get into a car that you probably weren't gonna get into or you're Yourself? questioning in your mind, you're like, ah, oh, it's not safe. And she jumps in it, you're like, you know, All right. newfound respect. <laughs> pretty cool, pretty All right. cool. So Brittany, I was kind of stalking you. I was checking out your Instagram. You're in Las Vegas a lot. What's the deal with that? <laughs> I do. I am in Vegas a lot, actually. Uh, and the reason for that is my husband, Kevin, who is my spotter on the show, uh, he actually grew up in Vegas. He lived there for most of his life in his teenage years, and he has a lot of family there. So Las Vegas, I'll be there at some point, <laughs> always. Well, tell your husband, I'm a Las Vegas native. I went to Clark High School. Tell him I said, hey. I absolutely will. <laughs> Brittany, Aaron, congratulations on Hyperdrive. Much success to you. It's an insane show. And when you have a chance, come out and visit us in Las Vegas. We'd love to see you as much as possible. Sounds Absolutely, good. Will. Thank you so much. And of course, if you want to see Hyperdrive, it launches on Wednesday, August 21st on Netflix. You can catch Hyperdrive streaming on Netflix, one of the most incredible, insane car competitions you've ever seen. And for more reviews and interviews, just surf on over to my website, VegasFilmCritic.com. I'm Jeffrey Gay Howard in Las Vegas. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you next time.